lizard bit on here and today I am bringing all of the Christmas fails to this channel because I am going to be sharing my Christmas decor haul so this is the first time that I brought like everything new um, I will be using stuff from last year when I lived at my other apartment with my sister but this year I'm in my very own apartment so I was very excited to decorate it how I want and buy a bunch of stuff um, but yeah I want to share it with you guys so if you're an early decorator like I am this year and this is definitely your type of video definitely stick around also remember to subscribe down below if you do enjoy Christmas as much as I do and if you're ready for all the Christmas videos because there will definitely be a lot more coming your way including vlogmas which I'll be doing this year but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's jump right into it so this is gonna be in no particular order I mainly brought a lot of my items from Target the majority of it is all from Target except for three items which I'm gonna just jump into now to get them over with but I did go to TJ Maxx last night and I just got three little things um the first thing is just this black base and this was $7.99 I just like the look of it I am kind of doing a black white and gold theme on this shelf I have here above my TV so I might add this in there somewhere or just somewhere in my living room but I just like the texture of it it's very nice and it's not too big so I might put a little bit of like greenery in there um, some flop stuff to make it look pretty nice the next thing I got which I actually saw in a lot of people's videos is this keep calm and drink hot cocoa sign so this was $3.99 from TJ Maxx and I'm actually gonna be putting this on my little hot chocolate station in my kitchen so you will be seeing that when I do my decorate with me video but I just thought it's really cute it's like a little Starbucks cup so I really like the design of this I'm not adding a lot of red into my decor but that sign I couldn't give up. For my bathroom I got this Castabelle Fresh Pine Scented Liquid Soap. I just really like the design of it. I just thought it was like, I don't know, Christmassy. It doesn't really smell like pine, like Christmas trees. It more so smells like maybe like a citrus, like pine smell. I mean, I don't know, but <laughs> I just like the design of it. It matches my bathroom with like the gold and the black top. So but this is really adorable so now moving into target i'm going to first share my christmas tree for this year now it is not going to be my permanent christmas tree forever because i do live in a small apartment i live in a studio apartment if you watch my studio apartment tour you will know the size of this apartment and that i don't really have it that much space so the christmas tree that i actually got is the wonder shop balsam artificial christmas tree this is the five foot unlit one and it does look a little bit sparse but I do like that look I kind of want to like that Charlie Brown Christmas tree and I feel like it does fit in the space that I want to put it which is the one that you just saw on the screen and I don't know I think once I like decorate it and bring it all together you'll see the vision that I'm going for but I think it fit perfectly in that area does it take up too much space I did want to put it in my living room area but I feel like it'll be a little bit too crowded so I'm just gonna leave it there for now um I will probably be decorating it in my vlogmas videos so you won't be seeing that in the apartment decorate with me um because I kind of want to do that separately to kind of bring in that Christmas spirit for the first day of vlogmas so we're just gonna go random from here so under the Christmas tree you did see this basket this is from project 62 at Target I'm going to be putting the Christmas tree in this because since it is so short I want to bring some height to it so I will be putting something in the bottom that you'll see in the video um, to give it that height so it'll be like six feet instead but I just like the idea of adding like a little basket I know a lot of people get the tree collars but that was too big obviously for my apartment and I just got in this like gray woven color I think this was about $24 didn't really know if I wanted to spend that much. I know I could have got it a little bit cheaper somewhere else, but I know I can use this over and over for other stuff and storage. To go inside the basket to kind of conceal the base of the Christmas tree, I got this from the Target Dollar Spot, and this is just a like cream color throw, and it's like this beautiful knitted, very soft actually. It's five dollars, and I love the color of it. As you could tell, I love my creams. So I thought that I add a nice like cohesive 
theme to the Christmas tree, um, especially with the ornaments that I will be decorating with this year. So I'll show you how I fix this to hide the base of that Christmas tree. Then for my ornaments, I actually saw this on Faye Claire's or Claire Faye, I don't know what her name is. <laughs> I don't know a lot of YouTuber names, but I follow her on Instagram as well here on YouTube and she posted these ornaments. And as soon as she posted them, I know everyone was going to go crazy. And every time I kept adding it to my cart, it kept saying out of stock. And then at the last second I added it, it said one in stock. I bought it and I got it. So this is from the Studio McGee um, Dress Shield brand. And I love these ornaments. They are a little bit big for the Christmas tree that I will be decorating. But I'm going to try and make it work. I'm not going to overload a Christmas tree. But they are just these beautiful neutral tone ornaments like I love these colors it's so pretty I'm happy that it's not a lot of ornaments that like they are big but it doesn't come with a lot but I just love the colors of these definitely what I'm going for so bringing like the neutral tones with the black and white but I love this a lot might have been a little bit pricey for this I think it was like $35 but I know I will be using it over and over and over again they're kind of like this like velvety feel so I love that a lot feels very luxe so I have these stockings which actually these are from TJ Maxx so we're doing a little interception because I thought I got these from Target but they're just these knitted stockings I love these so beautiful luckily I found two of them so I have one for me and one for my boyfriend um these were $15 each which is probably the same price as like the ones at Target but I will either be hanging it up here or on my TV stand because this might block the TV while I'm watching it but I just love these. They're so thick and very roomy in size, so you can definitely fit a lot of stocking stuffers in there. Next, I got one of my favorite items that I've always wanted every year, and this is the Wonder Shop Clear Lit Garland in the nine feet. And it just looks like this. You can see the picture. I didn't open it yet. You will be seeing it in my video. But I'm going to put it up here on this shelf to do my whole little like DIY fake mantle setup. <laughs> But I've always wanted one of these. Now, of course, I'm not going for a flock theme with my Christmas tree. But I still wanted the garland to be flocked. I kind of did want that, like, realistic-looking garland. But I could not find it anywhere for a decent price. So if you guys know somewhere that has it for a decent price, kind of like that cypress fur sort of um, natural-looking garland, definitely let me know. Maybe I could snag it for next year. But I'm just going to stick with that one for now. So I actually brought three pillows. Um, two of them are from a dollar spot. And I think the other one is just like from the regular Target like Wonder Shop collection. So this one I'm actually going to be putting on my couch. And this was $10 which I think is a great price. And it just says Merry Christmas with this little snowflake. Um, I actually have some two green pillows I'm going to use from Ikea also. So it kind of like that grayish green color. Which I think it'll tie in also with the ornaments to bring in that like black and white theme. And I like it a lot. And it's also, it's like reversible. So you can use this like when it's not Christmas time, which I thought was really smart for the price. And from the dollar spot section at Target, I kept seeing this and a lot of people's like shop with me. And this was five bucks. And it just says snuggle up. I might put on this little chair right here that I have. But I just love it. It's like a lumbar style pillow. It feels very nice and like very good quality um but I just love the writing on it once again my cream colors and then I got this one which doesn't really match it's going more for that like traditional Christmas style but it is just <laughs> this like tasseled um mistletoe design pillow this is also five dollars from the dollar spot but I don't know I still like it I think it could work depending on where I add it could maybe add it into my bedroom area on my bed but I just like it it looks like I don't know sometimes I like that traditional style Christmas stuff so that's why I had to pick it up so next I got these two deer so this one is like a brown goldish color which I love and they are a pretty big size these were I don't remember maybe five dollars yeah I believe it was five dollars but I love these this is so pretty I'm either going to put it on this mantle also or on my windowsill because I do have windowsills this year that I could decorate them I'm so excited about that but I love these. Definitely will be using them over and over and over. And I got this like pale blue color one because on this little area on this side, I have a lot of like blue decor. So I'm going to put it over there on the little like storage shelf that I have and tie in that little color. 
just so everything is kind of cohesive together. So for my windowsill, I actually picked these up from the dollar spot. These were $5 and they actually light up. I don't think I can test them right now, but they're just these little ceramic houses. I do have like the black metal houses and like barn looking ones that I'm going to be using either on the mantle or on the windowsill. But I just wanted to get these to tie in to create like a little village. So we'll see how that goes. I also got some black velvet ribbon. I'm either going to be using this for a Christmas presents or I do kind of want to do like the wreath hanging like ribbon tie things <laughs> on my kitchen cabinets. Um, I need to buy some more like mini wreaths. So for now, this is just for presents until I figure out that whole aspect. Next, I got this gold wreath. This is so beautiful. I don't remember the price of this and I don't know if it's available anymore on Target, but it just has like these little white snowball looking like berry things. Um, I'm actually going to hang this above my stove because my kitchen does have like gold detailing on the handles. So I thought that would look really nice, but I love this. It's very well made, beautiful. It kind of reminds me of like anthropology or like Urban Outfitters. And next are some greenery. So I got two of these picks from the Wonder Shop collection. They are $3 each. Again, going with the like flock theme to tie into the garland. I'm going to put these in some vases, maybe even that black one that I showed you guys earlier. But I love these. I always get these all year round. I have another um, pair of fit from a couple years ago. And I also have like a small flock Christmas tree that will also tie into the whole theme. So I love these very well made quality then I got this larger one which is like a bigger stem and this is from the Wonder Shop collection also this was 10 bucks I'm going to be putting it into a tall base that I have that's like a gold color um, it has actually like a mix of like regular green and the flock which I think is really great this is why I picked it up so it could tie into the Christmas tree as well as the garland and it's a pretty decent size so I really like that um, it's almost like the size of the top of a Christmas tree but I'm excited for this. Great price as well. And then these are from the Hearth and Hand collection. So this is kind of like the idea I was getting for like the natural garland that I wanted. But they're just these stems. They were a little bit more pricier than those. Um, but they are $7.99. Well, then again, the big one was $10. But I feel like it was worth the $10. I feel like these are a little bit like short at the top. And then the stem is just really long. But I might be bending them and putting them in like other bases, either in the kitchen or maybe in the bedroom area, but I just love the natural look of them. Couldn't pass it up, and I love the way that they hang very naturally. Next, I have two Christmas trees, and these are the bottle brush trees. So this one is just this cream, like, flocked color one, and then I had this brown one, which, as you can tell, it matches the ornaments that I have. These were both $10, which is a little bit pricey for these. I feel like they would have been great if they were, like, maybe half off, like $5.00. But I don't remember what brand this is from. I don't know if this is like the Wonder Shop. It doesn't say. But I still like them. I'm going to be using them in my windowsill um, for my little village decor. But I love these. Very beautiful. I'm sure you can find some that are cheaper at Target. But I just really like the colors of them. So now I have some signs to show you guys. So the first one I have is this Merry Christmas to All and to All a Good Night sign. It's just like this dark grayish blue green color. I'm going to be hanging this in my bathroom because my bathroom is like black, white, and green themed. So hang this up to add a little bit of Christmas spirit in there. And this was only five bucks from the Wonder Shop collection. Also from the Wonder Shop collection, I had this Merry Christmas sign. It's just in this gold color. This will either go in my kitchen on the counter or I'll put it up here on the mantle to add in the gold theme along with some other signs that I have. But I love this also it has that natural wood tone which matches the wood tones in my apartment and it's a pretty decent size as well. I got this little sign to add into my hot chocolate station and this says always homemade Frosty's coffee and cocoa served here and it's kind of like this dark blue sort of color like a greenish color with some like snowflakes and a little cup this was also five bucks from the wonder shop collection they have a ton of great signs over there so definitely check it out if you can especially right now because i'm sure they're selling out fast um i actually went to the target dollar spot in the city near my job and i found three signs which i love this year like i feel like i've never seen them at target before maybe i just wasn't looking 
but these signs are so beautiful to me um the first one i have says have yourself a merry little christmas and it just looks so nice so this is going on top of my shelf right here i just love it so nice looks so beautiful i have this one that says ho 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 it kind of gives me like coco chanel vibes i don't know why but it's just in this white color which will just like look nice with the black sign and then i have another one with the white and black and it's the twas the night before christmas so this is actually like the ending of the story which i thought was kind of different and a little bit better than like the beginning of it i thought it was cool that they did it that way instead so this will also be leaning on my shelf up there as well okay now we're getting into like miscellaneous stuff so I got these warm white twinkling LED lit starburst sets and it's a set of two. They were 20 bucks. I don't know why I bought this, but now that I know where I could put it, I kind of feel happy that I bought it. But for 20 bucks, I don't know, maybe it's worth it. Haven't opened it yet to see, but they're from the Wondershop collection. They're just like these little star um, lights. I don't think they're that small, but they do have a timer. They're battery operated and they also twinkle i believe you can have them twinkling so i'm gonna actually put them in my windows i have two windows so i'm gonna hang one on one side one on the other just to add that nice little holiday effect for some like faux outdoor <laughs> lighting because i do live in apartments so i can't decorate outside but i thought these were really pretty i might also hang them in my kitchen not sure yet to add a little bit of like nice lighting in there but we will see I got this nativity set and this was $15 from the Wonder Shop collection. I just thought it was so cute and minimal so it doesn't have like all like the um like the animals and stuff. It does have like two animals but it doesn't have like the three kings and whatnot. But I do love this and the color and everything is so nice so I will be setting this up also. Then I got these stocking holders. These were $10 which I think is a great price. They're just like these natural wood color with like a I think this is like a silver color hook um I'll either be putting them on the shelf but I thought like they're a little bit too heavy for that so I might just end up doing the stockings on the tv stand which is a great idea if you don't have a fireplace you can use your tv stand kind of to hang your stockings and this is also from the wonder shop collection so next I got these ornaments which were kind of bigger than I expected I thought they were going to be small so for my Christmas tree so we'll have to see how they work but they are just like these balls of yarn ornaments which i thought was so cute i don't remember the price of them i don't have like the bag that they were in but i think they're from the wonder shop collection also and they're just like this beautiful cream color i'll see how it works maybe i can hang on like some garland or somewhere or just put them as like a filler on something but couldn't pass them up definitely my kind of style another sign that i got is this merry christmas countdown and it's just this blue color so i'm putting it in the blue area of my apartment but it has like this little star i don't know if it's magnetic because it feels kind of like metal but it's kind of just count down you just move the star um to count down the dates of christmas so i will be doing that in vlogmas you will be seeing but i just like this a lot it was 15 dollars in the wonder shop collection then i had this garland which i wanted to put in the christmas tree but i feel like it's kind of too chunky for it so i'm just probably gonna like lay it around somewhere like on my table or the shelf and this is the like the black ball garland from wonder shop it was 10 bucks and just like this like wooden balls i really like it. it has like little hooks too so if you actually do want to hang it as a garland you can do that well not hooks but like little loops but i just love the color of this it's almost like a blue black color so it's really pretty i might just lay this like on a table around some decorations and see how that goes for my hot chocolate station i got this lazy susan from the dollar section for five dollars so i did get another like tiered um sort of tray but i don't know if i like the look of it it's arriving this week but i think i like this one better i prefer like the circular shape and i think for five dollars it was very much worth it um it's just like this like metal sort of tray and i'm sure you could fit mugs in the hair perfect tight and then do like a little decor on top so i'll be showing you how i do that in that video i also picked up this holiday barn gingerbread cookie kit this was actually the last one that we had um my boyfriend actually chose this one i asked him to pick out one that he wanted so he went with this one it's just like this holiday barn which i will be decorating in my blogmas so stay tuned for that but 
I just thought it was pretty cute. Um, this was, I don't remember the price of it. I don't know if it was like $10 maybe, but I think it's really cute, especially if you've had kids. You can never pass up building a gingerbread house. So we're down to the last items of this haul. So I actually got two of these lights for my Christmas trees. Um, these were $12 each from the Wonder Shop collection, and they are just these LED sphere lights. And they just look like that. I actually opened one so you guys can see. They're kind of like these like little ball lights. And when I plug them in, they look so beautiful. I know on the tree it just looks perfect. Because I'm kind of over the traditional lights that everyone uses for Christmas. So I think just like the smaller lights will look very nice on the Christmas tree that I did get. Next, I got these Scentsicles <laughs> Scented Ornaments. This is the White Winter Fur. I got these because I wanted my Christmas tree to smell like a real one because I couldn't get a real one this year. But I'm going to be hanging these inside a Christmas tree so it could smell really nice and add that Christmassy vibe to it. Um, next, my boyfriend picked out this ornament. I told him to pick one out to put on the tree. Um, this was, I believe, $3 from the Wonder Shop collection. It's just this, like leopard or cheetah i think he thinks it's a cheetah because it's his favorite animal so we just got this and i'm going to be throwing it up there when i do decorate i also got a pack of ornament hooks these were $1.50 from um the wonder shop collection i feel like they are a little bit too big for the christmas tree but we'll try to see if we can make it work then i got these two cups which i love so much they are plastic they're from the Threshold brand, and they were only, I believe, $3, I remember. So the first one is this Fa La 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 design one in different colors. I don't know if you can see that because it is clear. And then I also got this, like, sparkle gold-looking one, and here they're plastic. I love them a lot. Might be using them to put, like, candy and stuff in as decor or drink out of them, whichever floats my boat but i like these a lot can it pass them up and then last but not least i got some like little food stuff so i got these two dark chocolate coated with peppermint marshmallows from the wonder shop collection these were 1.99 each i got these last year for stocking stuffers i'm just getting them now for like my decor in my kitchen I'll probably eat them pretty soon but i love these it tastes so yummy and then for my hot chocolate uh, station, I got these Peppermint Crunch from the Wonder Shop collection. These were, I think, like three something. Oh no, $2.99. So they're just these. I want to get like the bigger pack from TJ Maxx. I found one last night, but I think it was open. So that's why I didn't want to pick it up. So I just left it there. Luckily, I had these. So I'm going to be pouring these into like little glass jars that I brought to add into that station. So that is my huge target christmas haul slash tj maxx i'm so excited this year to decorate because once again i'm in my own space and i could decorate it to my fullest potential of how i want it to look which i will be filming this week so stay tuned for that video if you guys are in the christmas spirit like i am and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this one and stay tuned for the upcoming christmas videos definitely click that subscribe button down below and that notification bell so you can get notified when those videos do come up and if you enjoyed this one definitely give it a big thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next one bye